ECG Monitoring and 12 Lead ECG. The X Series Advanced, if factory defaults are configured, powers on in PADS Lead View. If the PADS are connected to the patient first, the device will remain in the PADS Lead View. If the 4 Lead ECG cable is connected to the patient first, the device will switch to the Lead 2 View. This will occur only on the initial ECG monitoring connection to the patient. By using the Leads Select button, alternative views can be obtained. Press the Leads Select button multiple times to scroll through all available lead views, including PADS view and any V leads attached to the patient. An optional way to change lead view is to highlight the lead using the navigation keys pressing the Select button and selecting an alternate lead view from the drop-down list of available lead views. Note that the Lead Select button only affects the top ECG tracing. Also, if configured, the X-Series Advanced will automatically switch to the PADS view when the Analyze, Energy Select, or Charge button is pushed. Multiple ECG lead views, as well as other available waveforms, can be added to the screen. Highlight the lead label, such as Lead 2, and press the Select button. Scroll down towards the bottom of the drop-down menu. Select Insert and press the Select button. Then, select from the available lead views to insert, such as Lead 3. Choose one and press the Select button again. Waveforms can be removed from the screen. With the exception of the top ECG tracing, any waveform can be removed from the screen by highlighting its label, pressing the Select button. Choose Remove and press the Select button again. The waveform is now removed from the screen. Press the 12-lead ECG key to open the 12-lead ECG screen. This provides a diagnostic filter view of all 12 leads on the screen to check the quality of the tracings before the 12-lead ECG is acquired. To acquire a 12-lead ECG, press the 12-lead acquisition icon, camera 12 button. The X-Series Advance can be configured to prompt the provider to enter any patient information. This is only done prior to the initial 12-lead ECG. After entering the required information, press the 12-lead ECG acquisition key a second time to begin the process. It will take 10 seconds to acquire a 12-lead ECG. If needed, a stop key is available during the acquisition, which will cancel the acquisition. Once the acquisition is complete, the X-Series Advanced will save the 12 lead, provide the InnoVise algorithm's interpretive statement, display the interpretive statement on the screen, and, if configured to do so, begin to print a copy of the 12 lead ECG. The screen will be split into two views. The left is the analysis page and shows information related to the newly acquired 12-lead ECG and the InnoVise algorithm's interpretive statement. The right screen is real-time view, defaulting to the live view of leads 1, 2, 3, AVR, AVL, and AVF. Press the 12 Lead Review Next key to advance to the next analysis page. This page provides patient information as well as related measurements, including STJ measurements. Pressing the 12 Lead Review Next key a second time will display page 1 of the 12 Lead ECG snapshots. Note that leads 1, 2, 3, AVR, AVL, and AVF from their acquisition are shown on the left, and the corresponding live view of the same leads is shown on the right. The X-Series Advanced records a full 10 seconds of each lead and divides into four separate 12 lead snapshot pages. Each page represents 2.5 seconds from the acquisition. Press the 12 lead review next key to scroll. 
to view leads V1 through V6 on any of the snapshot pages. Simply press the Lead Select button to toggle between the two sets of lead views. Press the Print key to print another copy of the same 12 lead that was just acquired. If the device is configured for hybrid printing, press the Print key on snapshot pages 2, 3, or 4 to print a 12 lead using information from that page only in a single 2.5 second time frame. The 12 lead ECG can be transmitted to a facility using pre configured Wi Fi, Bluetooth, or cellular connections. Press the Transmit key to access a list of available distribution points. Use the navigation keys to select the desired destination and then confirm by pressing the Select button. A green check mark will appear next to the selected facility. Scroll to the Transmit option and press Select. The transmission process will begin. The green LED light on the top of the X-Series Advanced will illuminate while the device is communicating with the server. If successful, the words Transmission Complete will appear in green above the 12 lead snapshot page. If unsuccessful, the words Transmission Failed will appear in the same location. Press the back key to return to the 12 lead menu and diagnostic 12 lead ECG screen. Press the 12 lead archive key to access a list of available 12 lead ECG snapshots in the device. The most recent will be the first entry in the list. Selecting one of the ECGs will return to the static dynamic view screen to review, print, or transmit that 12 lead ECG. Press the contrast button to change the display to a high contrast black and white view. Press again to return to the color display. If configured, a screen that can be viewed using night vision goggles is also available. Exit the 12 lead ECG functions by either pressing Exit 12 lead or Home buttons.